What's happening guys? My name is Matthew Ogus and I'm in the kitchen today because I'm going to show you how to cook tilapia in bulk. It's going to taste good, it's going to feel good. So, you probably have a higher protein intake, you're trying to put on some muscle, gain some strength. Tilapia is a really cheap, inexpensive protein source for you to get your protein in for the day. Let's get right to it guys. Usually every weekend or perhaps every other weekend, I like to cook up a big batch of meat. Right here I have 10 pounds of tilapia that I'm going to cook up today. Step one is to get this bad boy started by preheating your oven to 425 degrees. Step number two, lightly rinse your tilapia under some running water. The next step is we're going to take our tilapia fillets that are nice and thawed and put them on our greased or you know, lightly uh, non-stick cooking sprayed pans right here. We have four pans since we're going to cook up like 10 pounds of tilapia get it out of the way for the week. Boom, boom, spice these bad boys up. Start off with onion powder, Ooh, onion powder, Ooh, black pepper. We have some garlic and garlic salt. Boom. Oh, last but not least. Last but not least, lemon pepper. Boom. You do one side, flip them over, and do the other side. Fastest way to do this is with a whole pan full of tilapias, or all these pans full of tilapias. Get them all done at once. Save a lot of time. Efficiency, baby. Okay guys, our tilapia is all seasoned up. Let's put this in the oven at 425 degrees for about 12 to 15 minutes, or until flaky. All right guys, the fish is all done now. Let's take this out and set it on a counter so that it can cool off. Okay guys, now that the flappy's all cooked, there's a few different ways we can go about putting it in the fridge, depending on your lifestyle. So let's just say uh, you wanna just put it in the fridge, you plan on eating all of the fish, whether it's a couple pounds or five pounds within a few days, totally cool. Put it in a container that you can seal or put a top on, put it in your fridge. Uh, if you want to eat this throughout a week or two, you're going to want to freeze these obviously. And my best recommendation is to put these in Ziploc baggies like this. And I actually reuse these. So this might be the second or third time using this particular one. I'll put how much ever tilapia fillets constitutes a serving for me. For me, I like to have usually about two, maybe two and a half tilapia fillets. For you, it might be one or one and a half. Or if you perhaps want to meal prep for the next few days, Put a tilapia or two, however much you like to call serving, in you know Tupperware little Tupperware things, and put in whatever else foods you put in there: uh, asparagus, uh, fruits, uh, vegetables, potatoes, whatever, and set those in your refrigerator. Uh, for me, I like to just prep the meats. So all I do is I'll just prep the meat and then prep the carbs as each meal comes up throughout the day, throughout the week. So however you go about this, that's your business. Guys, one last recommendation. I really enjoy having just regular vinegar, white distilled vinegar with my tilapia. Pour a little bit in a bowl, take the fish, put it on your fork, dip it in there. Mmm, tastes delicious. Try it. Anyways guys, thanks so much for joining us in this tilapia cooking in bulk video. Hope you enjoyed it. And for those who didn't really know how to do this, I hope you know how to do this. So, Go on, make your meats, eat throughout the week, and enjoy your bodybuilding and fitness lifestyle. For those of you guys wondering, uh, this is one of the new Gymshark Seamless Fit Tank Tops that's available on Gymshark.com. You can get it there, or you can click the link in my description box below if you want to show support to this channel. Helps me out a little bit, and you can use the code MATTLEGAS10 for 10% off. So once again, you know, link in the description box, click that, and if you're interested in this, check it out. One of my new favorite pieces of apparel. Anyways guys, thanks a lot for joining us and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.